doing? Oh, I'm making, making tomato cages. Today, Ryan's going to show you how to make your own homemade tomato cages right. out of a roll of, what is that, just iron? Yeah. Iron wire? Like fencing? fencing? Yeah, like cattle panel fencing? It's it actually rusty. It is rusty. It's got to move. It's a little yeah. rusty, but that's not going to hurt nothing. I think we have it there. Oh, I just want to see what well, it's going to look like. Well, Wobble says they wobble house, but we can set that as a booby trap. No, it's going to be a tomato cage. That's, yeah, that's perfect. Yeah, big enough? Yeah. All right, yeah, here. But, uh, Mommy, we know your great trap. Come and hold it. Come we know your great our neighbor. Yeah. Just if we, you get out of the way of my camera, please. Yeah. Every time you guys are in my videos, YouTube shuts off all my comments. I don't know why. They think somebody's going to make a comment about you or something. I don't know. Whoa. Joseph, watch out. Because this is coming back. Gonna... Come back and hit you. It's going to hurt you. My dad's got his foot on it. Now I want to shoot back and get me in And you just used your bolt cutters there? All you gotta do is use your bolt cutters. And to clip it. And you know what you do? Yep. And you take this. But, 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 but Grace had one of those. Ow. You need to wrap the wires around. But yeah, no. the clip. No, it needs to go like this, yes. Uh, Get away from it before it pokes you. Yes. It just poked me, but I got my blue jeans on. Ow. You need a pair of pliers? Yeah, I did. I did with my hands. I got my hands. Yeah. Yeah, He's just bending that wire around and making a loop to lock it. Sis, watch out, baby. Oh, you tough, though, man. This is part of a building class, Joseph. Mm -hmm. This is called construction class. This is called build your own, own and stuff. DIY. That's huge. It's bent a little bit. I think my dad had that great big wire, or did that come from Uncle Dale's? I got this from Dale. You got that from Uncle Dale. Yep. That he had and he didn't need it, so he's like, here, take it home, make some tomato cages. <sighs> Like, did he use to make two tomato cages? Yeah, when he had a garden. Wait, was it was that rusty? Probably not as rusty as it is now. Wait, wait, was it clean? He bent it a little too far, but that's all right. Like, did, did he need it for itself? Yep. And, and, and he said he didn't want it anymore? Nope, he didn't have a use for it anymore, so he gave it to Daddy. Yeah? Yep. To, to make tomato cages. To make tomato cages. And everybody can pick our tomatoes. Oh, we are picking our tomatoes. Because we can our tomatoes, baby. Or freeze them. And my frozen green peppers turned out great. They worked all season I think I used I think I've only got like two or three left in there one, from last one fall did you see? there's one there's a brand new light. now let me back up let's see there's daddy how, how tall is it compared to you that's how tall it is but that's good because then when we get some big tomato plants they'll actually be able to grow in there yeah you cold okay so as you can tell these are the tomato cages we had last year but really they're more like green pepper cages but we used them for our tomatoes because we didn't have any but you can tell those are a lot shorter because there's my posts for my owl to scare any kind of animals out of my garden oh here's the one I was like where's the ones he just made at he made three well I went inside took jo Jolene in I don't know if you can see them very well against the ground but there's one two three. Gosh, it's so hard to see him against the ground on my video. Hold on, Joseph. But there, you can see he took and made three
three cages out of that roll already, and then he's still got some left. So that's how easy it is to DIY and make your own tomato cages, guys. Please give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more helpful gardening information.